Hello everyone, I'm the Modern Sea Witch. I'm back with another unboxing. This time it is the April box from The Witch's Roots. Let's see what they have inside for us. Oh, okay, so that's a really nice oracle card. Passion. Passion is an inner flame that will keep you striving towards your vision. Okay, so this month's box is reflecting on spring and Ostara. All right, so everything in here will be kind of reflecting that. So we'll take a look and see what we have. Bend this back a little bit. Oh, this is really a nice piece of artwork here. That'll be great in your grimoire or even just on display. Uh, it's a poem from Yeats. All right, that's wonderful. Look at the little fairies and the fairy garden. Oh, I think that's going to be a re recurring theme for this box. The fairy garden. Oh, nice. So we have a um, grimoire page about rose hips and all of its correspondences. Rose hips, um, I love using their oil, um, an infusion of their oil for your skin. It's really nice. Okay, what else do we have here? All right, so it looks like we have a stone. I will have to look at the sheet to tell what that is exactly, but it is beautiful. It's a nice little polished stone with a little bit of gray and purplish magenta more than purple, I guess. That's interesting. I'm not great at identifying stones. I'm still learning those. Okay, and we've got a bottle here. great that they package things well so that things don't break in shipping. Okay, so we have Twinkle Offering. Oh, and we definitely have some herbs in there. So this is a ritual anointing oil. Oh, wow. So this is an oracle deck. So this is The Forest Fay by Nadia Turner. That's really nice. So this one has 40 cards. Enter the forest, seek wonder and enchantment, and hear the curious messages of the Forest Fay. This set of 40 magical cards invites you to delight in your imagination and spark joy and inspiration. Go beyond the between this world I'm sorry, going, go beyond <laughs> the boundary between this world and that to escape your way into the forest and to magic. Wonderful. That, I really like this artwork. That's special. I, I love when you get a surprise like that. Okay, let's see what we have here. Oh, I think this is a ritual candle. Because there are some herbs here. And I thought they were flying everywhere. So nice. It's a lovely candle covered in lavender. Beeswax candle. And I forgot to mention earlier that I'm not affiliated with uh, the Witch's Moon that uh, the Witch's Roots box is from. 
Um, I do like what I've seen from them so far in the couple of boxes that I've seen. Um, so I, I do highly recommend them. Okay, so we have some more incense. I love incense. I'm burning some right now. Um, let's see. This one is Spring Awakening. Mm, it's very nice and floral. The uh, forest floor uh, that I got from them last month is really nice. Oh, wow. That is a nice bit of rose hips. That is really nice. All right. Let's make sure we just didn't miss anything in there. All right. Wonderful. So, again, this particular box retails for, I think off the top of my head, um, I want to say $33, including the shipping. I will double check that figure for you and let you know for sure. But everything that they have provided us, I believe, is more, 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 well, more than um, $33. So let's see here. We've got, I'm going to leave that in that paper because of the rose, I'm sorry, the lavender buds. We've got the rose hips. We've got the Forest Bay box of uh, Oracle cards. That deck alone, that makes this box. Besides just the two pieces of artwork that just make your grimoire even more beautiful. And we'll see this one about rose hips. Passion. <laughs> that card, I have a couple of Oracle decks, and that uh, theme keeps coming up for me. And I, yes, I, I love being reminded that I need to follow my passion. And some more oil. And that stone. So let's see here. All right, so we have our rose hips. And the Grimoire page uh, artwork about the about rose hips. We had the Forest Bay Enchantment deck, the Yates poem uh, artwork page, the Anointing Oil. Let's see what's in that. So it has a Lang Lang and Yasmin, um, not Yasmin, <laughs> Jasmine um, essential oils along with herbs of dandelion and lavender leaf. Boy, I cannot speak today. Or rather, I can't even read. Um, lavender and dandelion. Uh, and there, inside the oil is Lemurian quartz. Okay. And then let's see here. This is a plum blossom, tumbled tourmaline. That, like I said, that is just gorgeous. Uh, it's a stone for calming anxiety and fear. And it carries energies of peaceful vibrations and relaxation. It's wonderful. And we have that incense, the spell candle. So they've hand rolled that fairy passage mini spell candle with the intention of opening doorways for you to place offering, offerings and ask for guidance from the Fey folk. Wonderful. That is going to be a great time of year for that. Um, if you have any interest in that, you know, create a little fairy garden, leave offerings for them so they'll come and visit you and build a relationship with them. Wonderful. Okay. So, yes, I, again, I'm going to say that this box is well worth the money that I paid and I highly recommend uh, the boxes that I've been receiving uh, from the Witch's Moon and would definitely um, recommend that you check them out. Okay, I took a second to get everything laid out here so you can see it better. I am just absolutely enamored with this box. Um, everything that they've included was so thoughtful. The rose hips, the, the spell candle. It's not just a, a plain candle that you can use. Uh, they've already anointed it. They have a specific ritual in mind for it. Uh, of course, you know, the lavender dried in shipment, but we can always put 
some more of the anointing oil on and reapply those lavender buds or get some more if you have some um, before you actually perform the ritual they provided. This, this box of oracle cards was completely unexpected. They're gorgeous. They feel great in my hand. It's a great size, a great travel deck. Um, I can see me taking this all over, especially out into the garden. Um, you know, it's that time of year where we're starting to want to be outside. Um, and this is a great portable deck for that. Um, I'm really liking this artwork. And uh, even if you don't... Um, uh, practice witchcraft um, and you maybe just have an interest in the fae go to the witchesmoon.com and see if they happen to have any overstock on the box uh, for this month sometimes they do um, and be sure to check it out um, I can't say enough about this particular company the quality of the ingredients they've been providing has been phenomenal um, so yes, definitely check them out on thewitchesmoon.com. Be sure to check out my blog on modernseawitch.com. Keep up with me there. And in between blog posts, you can keep up with me on Instagram and other social media platforms. And my handle on all of those is at Modern Sea Witch. All right. Well, thank you for joining me. Be sure to leave any comments below. Subscribe to the channel. Give us a thumbs up so that uh, I know what you want to see in the future and have a great day. Thanks for joining me.